honestly, if you're trying to give up coffee, herbal coffee is where it's at. My hair is officially falling out, guys. <laughs> this is like my dream come true. <laughs> Good morning. Ah, everyone's awake. Time to start the day. Okay. Hi, honey. He doesn't actually sleep like this. I have him swaddled up, but he already had his morning poop. Mommy. Good morning. Mommy. Yes. Daddy, go to the gym. Oh. Okay. I'll be back. He'll be back. Did you have breakfast? I'm good. I have bacon. You wanna see Oakley? We <laughs> go. Get like. Get go. Get go. Okay. Help me make the bed. Uh, okay. Okay. I'll be back. Too heavy. That's not how we make the bed. Oakley, you see what I have to deal with? When they talk about the three nature stage, it's true. Sage is now in a phase where she like runs into a room and slams the door like she's this 13 year old. It's kind of funny, but also like she's dealing with emotions. Yes, yeah, Sage. <laughs> okay, hang on. I gotta deal with this teenager. Hi, why do you slam doors? It's not dark. It's not dark? Okay, we're all better now. Look at that. I think I talked about these in my What I Eat In A Day video, but I just tried this flavor, French Roast from Ticino. It's really good. It has organic coffee flavor in it, but it's still caffeine free. I brought just enough collagen for this trip. Tea bag, collagen. Only four drops, this stuff's strong. <laughs> Oakley's hanging out in his bouncer. You got some toys here. This will buy me at least like, I don't know, 10 to 20 minutes to Make my herbal coffee. If we can, we like to start off with toys instead of the uh, television in the morning. Who's that? A Marshall Jamma. That's Marshall's Jamma's? Oh. We love some quiet, independent playtime in the morning, don't we? A make. Matt actually got them. They're from Melissa and Doug, and they're magnetic and stuff. And we are She's been loving them. Okay, Mama's gonna finish and because we don't get enough casual content, hi baby, hi baby. She gets lots of love, don't you worry. It's just hard to film her when we each got a kid, but she's always around, part of the family. She's loving these bean bags. <laughs> That's her dog bed. This is what she prefers. I don't blame her. These are the Simple Mills almond flour pancakes. Leftover pancakes. Chloe also made some fried plantains, just like on the stove top with olive oil and a little sea salt oh and i think those have cinnamon on them so delicious if you've never had plantains i know it's a little intimidating you want to wait till they're uh, nice and ripe if you're going to cook them like this like sweet but they're so good whoa look at the whole cruise here i honestly love her imagination this is mornings you wanna call? He's he's working out so he can be strong. Let's try a plantain. Mm. Honestly, if you're trying to give up coffee, herbal coffee is where it's at. It has such a yummy flavor. Yes, there's no caffeine, but eventually you just get used to it. And honestly, I just don't do well with caffeine. I feel like a lot of people these days don't. If you're trying to give it up, herbal coffee. cheese on the eggs and I put cinnamon on the pancakes. Sage is bugging Chloe so I have an opportunity to eat breakfast in silence until he starts whining. Whoa. <laughs> I'm telling you when you have babies you live your life in like two hour increments. They wake up, change the diaper, feed them, play, back to bed. Which kind of makes it easy to like plan your day but also you know it's go go go. What? My hair is officially falling out, guys. It's the second hair I found in this food. The postpartum hair loss has begun. I always tell people it's around like the three, 
four month mark. People think it's early, like as soon as you have the baby and they're like, oh, it's not happening to me. I'm like, no, 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 it's coming, it's coming. You're not the special one, trust me. Most people get it. It is what it is, part of creating these cute little humans. We are heading into Pompano today. It's a really cute beachside town. Our friends come to Florida, I think for about a month every year during the winter. And so we're gonna see them today for like a lunch and go see the beach and walk on the pier. It's a really cute area. And honestly, I feel like I've only vlogged in the house and not when we're out doing stuff, but I've done a ton of like TikToks and reels. So make sure you're following me and you can check out what we've been up to. I've just been trying to be more in the moment this trip and not be vlogging everything but it is easy to grab like vertical footage on my phone i just feel like it's hard to do it all it's overwhelming so i'm just like i don't need to have everything documented everywhere follow me on instagram and stuff if you want like our daily stuff do my hair mommy do my hair mm -hmm. let me see it's so beautiful do you want to leave it down no no what would you like a braid or a ponytail Sage, it looks so nice down. You want, you want, how many braids do you want? Braids. Three? Yes. Three? Yeah. We gotta go in like an hour. I don't even know if I'll have time to meditate before we go. I'll probably do it when we get back. Let's go. Let's go. Giving him a little top up and then we're gonna go. Hopefully he naps in the car. He's tired. He's tired. Yeah, he's like over tired. This is what breastfeeding is really like. It's not always calm and peaceful. Oh, I know. Shh. Hi, my love. Let's get your little sandals on. You gonna have a nappy poo in the car? And then we got a little sweater for him in case he gets chilly. I have a whole blog post that you guys should check out. I'll link it down below on using an organizer like this to pack for your little ones. This is honestly the best organization system for when you are traveling. I have two of them. They fold up flat too when you're home and not using them. And everything just fits. You can organize them by like socks, sleepers. When it comes to small clothes, they just get really lost and it's hard to see everything. And I love this organizer. I keep it like this during our whole trip. And then it's really easy just to pack it into the suitcase when you leave cannot recommend this enough life hack and this is what i'm wearing i just have these joggers and the shirt that has can you see like an open back in the back and i love it super cozy i might be wearing him so i just wanted something that i can be cool in it's like 20 degrees celsius today so i'm like pants sleeveless shirt i think we're gonna be good i actually recently got a bunch of active wear i'll link this outfit down below if i can find the links but it is so cozy and it's actually long so you can have it kind of up or however you like it's a good mom outfit look at the cutest sandals i cannot get over these i can't get over them i can't get over them okay let's go get your teether your blanket and let's get you in the car seat because we gotta go by the way this guy hit a huge milestone while we've been on this trip he finally rolled over he's been trying to do it for a few days and then he finally did it the other day i'll insert a clip it was so cute i only got the tail end of it because chloe and i were like bickering about something and then we're like oh, he's rolling and then he rolled and rolled back so it was really cool to catch some of it on tape and so now he's just like forever trying to roll again you see me rolling the hayden Trying to catch me riding dirty. Ooh. Oh, you kick, kick, kick. Okay, is ready to go. He's got his teether. I got this little yes. car seat Thank toy. All the fun stuff from Mr. Oki. Okay, the kids are heading to the car and I want to do a really quick unboxing. Guys, this is a big deal. I got myself my first like big girl sunglasses. And I know they're so basic. So many people have these. I don't care. I like them and I'm going to wear them today. Girl, I saw a mom the other day at the park wearing the exact same ones because like I said, a lot of people have them. And I was like, yes, I really do like them. And it turns out it's actually cheaper for us to get them while we're in the States. So I was like, I'm going to get them. Like, oh, they're just like that you know i like them i like them kind of like my push present to myself slash just treating myself because i always feel guilty spending any money on myself especially when it comes to like luxury items like i don't have anything designer and 
I don't know, I just feel special. Okay, we gotta go. Matt's already looking at me like, what are you doing? Just a little sunglass unboxing. We just finished grocery shopping, picking up some snacks for our road trip back home later this week. Matt and Chloe just went to go use the washroom. Ooh, it's, the sun's coming out. And Oakley's napping, Sage is playing, and we're good. We're good. I, actually, I gotta take the sweater off. The weather here is like one minute, it's chill. It's like, if there's a cloud, you're like, oh, it's kind of chilly. And then once the sun comes out, you're like, oh, it's hot. Take off all the layers. Can we just talk about the last couple weeks here have been so crazy with just the events that have occurred. Like within a week, we had my sister, Matt, and my two babies, Oakley and Sage, all got trapped in an elevator for like 40 minutes. I did a whole story time, get ready with me, on my Instagram and TikTok. And then within that same week, Sage got stung by, it's like a man of war, it looks like a jellyfish, but it's not. And honestly, that was way worse than the elevator thing because that, once they sting you, it's like a venomous, venomous sting. And it basically, the rash comes back over the next few weeks. So we thought it was all good. And then all of a sudden her foot was swollen and rashy and hives up her legs. It was a whole thing. And I, it was only a small like tentacle or whatever that was on her foot. I can only imagine if something was like wrapped around her leg or whatnot, like so scary. Uh, luckily she didn't have like a major allergic reaction or anything from it but within a week that happened and we're just like is Florida rejecting us <laughs> she's such a brave little girl and she doesn't really want to go to the beach right now apparently they're really common this time of year I'm just happy that's over with but yeah go follow me on Instagram and TikTok if you want to see like more of a story time about it she just keeps saying no mommy I don't want to go to the beach Jelly. she at least knows it was a jellyfish we just call it a jellyfish a jellyfish that stung her because I don't want her to be just scared of the ocean like the water stung her so she does understand that it was a jellyfish and she's like I don't like jellyfish they're not nice and which is true they're not nice oh my sister and Matt are getting back kids are cranky we gotta go we're meeting our friends in like half an hour uh, for lunch and I'm getting hungry I have to pee too so I'm just gonna go pee at the restaurant I was telling I don't want to I was like I know Went to the gym this morning. I always drink like a lot more water. Like, work out. I'm so proud of you. Matt signed up for uh, like a month at a CrossFit near us and he's been going like a few times a week. And I feel like it's always so much harder to work out when you're away from home. Yeah. I'd like to have gone so. more. But... You still went a lot. So you should be proud. Look at our cool sunglasses. Matt got sunnies for Christmas and I got some for just being a mom. Having pushing babies out of my body. <laughs> dream come true <laughs> when you go out for lunch with another foodie Bye. <laughs> everything looks so good we ordered everything on the menu i'm just topping oakley off he also had a blowout i don't know if you can see it but we're gonna give you some milk change him the lighting's really weird here um lunch was so good we had like a three hour lunch and now we're at a dog park so cashew can run around I'm gonna bring his uh, carrier so we can walk around after you're done. This guy had two poop explosions in the car, so we're in a new outfit. We're gonna go for a little pre-dinner walk. Okay, you watch a movie. We are picking our battles today. Hat on. Okay, Mr. Oki, let's go for a walk. We are picking our battles with this one today. Cashew! Hi, baby! Hi! 
Hi. It is another day. I forgot to end this vlog, but I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you like when I share our family travel vlogs. Also, don't forget to subscribe. I post new videos here every single week. We are just actually getting ready to pack. We leave super early tomorrow morning. Tonight, we're heading for a little fun barbecue at my friend's place, which I think is the perfect way to wrap up our last official date in Florida. We got some suitcases back there. I think Matt's outside enjoying the sunshine and Seiji is hopefully napping. So I'm gonna do a couple things. We're just like wrapping everything up before we go to our friend's place. But thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. See you back in Canada.